the Aintree Juvenile Handicap Hurdle is next. So we're off to Liverpool now for the final meeting of the season. Our final race is all coming from here. It's finals day, of course, in the SO7 races and the Moors Millions. But this, first of all, is a 0 to 1 24 year old hurdle over two miles. Cool Hollander at the top for Martinilum. Champion Moose David Robertson. Loves no friend Martinilum. Lemonade Joshua Sutherland. Sono Epaulet. Padre Hogan. You greet for Graham Clutterbuck. Judy T. Obi Wan. Western Province Paul Rhodes. Bell Harbour Stu Gray. Junior Days Obi Wan. Anne Marie's Bling Stu Gray. And Irina Bay for Alex Cherry. So 12 of them then. The rain's coming down, and away they go. So two miles on this sharp track, then they get into the first flight, and they're all safely over the first, with Cool Highlander taking them along in front from Champion Moose in second. And Irene Bay on the outside, and Irene Bay is now swinging through, and is pretty keen to lead, it would seem, and has quickly put two or three lengths between herself and the rest of them, and no hanging about here, as Irina Bay quickly opens up by four, even five now, so Irina Bay is keen to get in and out of the rain and get her season over and done with by the looks of things, and she's gone well clear, and is certainly putting the pace to this race as they get over the second flight. So Irina Bay, well clear of Judy T in second, then Champion Moose and Cool Hollander as they take the third, after Cool Honda is so epilet, then lost no friend on the inside. And the purple and white stripes looking towards the back lemonade for Joshua Sutherland, just the back marker at this point. And they're passing the stand then, past the winning post, past the water jump of the Grand National Course, which will be being used later, of course, for the two Moors Millions races. And they're swinging now, left handed and out, onto the back part of the track. And Irina Bay is leading by six lengths to Juni T in second, Champion Moose is third, Cool Hollander back in fourth, and then Solo Epilet, Lewis No Friend, and Bell Harbour, Lemonade's made a bit of a forward move, in Western Province, Anne Marie's Bling Junior Days, and finally you greet at the back of the field. So Irina Bay then. Is she setting this up for a closer? Well, she is, she's not setting up for another one for Alex because he's only got the one in it. And Irina Bay skips over that in the lead from Champion Moose in second, Judy T third, Cool Hollander moves on to the outside now in fourth, and Solo Epilet is fifth. Loves no friends after that one in sixth as they get over flight number five. Cool Hollander was a bit slow over that one. A forward move being made by Bell Harbour in towards the back. Amory's Bling is now last as they get over the sixth. And all safely over that one with Irina Bay. Two lengths clear of Champion Moose in second. Julie T third. Cool on and now being driven up on the inside of that one. Then comes Solo Epilet. Bit of a gap then to Junior Days in Western Province. Lost no friend. Just lost his place on the inside behind that one. Is your Greek trying to make a forward move. Bell Harbour trying to hold it in as they get over the third from home. And over that one, Irina Bay's lead is down to little more than a length. Judy T is in second. Champion Moose is third. Cool Hollander fourth. Western Province has come out of that pack into fifth and looks to be going well. Looks a big danger as they come down towards the final three furlongs and the final two flights. And Irina Bay is kicked on again. Cool Hollander's gone into second. Champion Moose is third. These three are clear. Your Greet is coming through with a strong looking one on the outside. Julie T is coming back into it. So too is Love Snow Friend. It's wide open as they get over the second last. And it was just Cool Hollander in the lead. Cool Hollander from Champion Moose. Irina Bay and Julie T. Julie Junior Days is absolutely flying as they come down on the final flight and over it they go and it's Cool Hollander who got over it best Cool Hollander's in the lead but Champion Moose is fighting back so too is Junior Days Cool Hollander in front Jockey has a little look round he could do with carrying on riding instead and it's Cool Hollander who's just about going to hold on I think as they race up towards the line now Cool Hollander just from Champion Moose and Junior Days and a great and loves no friend and then Julie T and Western Province and the Jockey on Cool Hollander was just been a bit too cool for my liking there as he hangs on to take it. So Cool Hollander the winner for Martin Leadham. Champion Moose was second for David Robertson. Junior Days Obi Wan was third. You greet for Grand Clutter was fourth and Judy T for Obi Wan was fifth.